Greetings, Matriarch. Master Orgus Din has sent me to help you fight the Flesh Raiders. So the Jedi finally deign to recognize my people's suffering. How noble. Nothing to do with the attack on your training grounds, I'm sure. We didn't realize how great a threat the Flesh Raiders had become. And now you seek help from the people you once ignored. My scouts have tracked the Flesh Raiders for months. Watch them grow in strength. I will share what we've discovered. But only if you agree to protect my people, we... We suffer. Mother, you need rest. Let me carry this burden for you. With all due respect, time is a factor. I need that information. This is my daughter, Rana Dalven. She and Scout Chief Morint here will speak for me. I must attend to... other matters. Personally, I don't care why you've come. As long as you destroy the Flesh Raiders. Ever since they got their new weapons and gear, they hunt us like animals. The enemy has a camp in the valley nearby. My scouts say the Flesh Raiders store their weapons and other tech in a cave. Removing that technology will neutralize the Flesh Raiders. We need to strike fear into the Flesh Raiders, sabotage their weapons. Fix it so they blow up in their ugly faces. How would we do that? Their technology is standard Republic design. We could overload the power circuits and plasma coils. Here, I'll show you. Sabotage would thin the Flesh Raider numbers and eliminate their technological advantage. If you brought that technology here, we could defend ourselves with those weapons. This village is vulnerable to attack. You need better defenses. This debate is pointless unless you can get inside that cave. You'll need one of the leader's access keys. Find the Flesh Raider technology and do what you think is best. Good luck, Master Jedi. Once they have all this, the Twi'leks can defend themselves. Don't worry, little guy. I'll get you out of here. Good thing the Flesh Raiders don't eat droids. Teach our soldiers how to use these weapons. Train them on the Twi'lek invaders. When will we strike against the Jedi? Patience, Caliph. The Jedi will fall when our army reaches full strength. Never understood the need for restraining bolts anyway. She died in my arms. You should have seen what those filth did to her! I'm sorry, Selu. We all share your loss. For every one of us the Flesh Raiders butcher, we should kill ten! No, no, a hundred! Will that restore your loved one to life? Don't lecture me, Jedi! My wife is dead! Our people slaughtered! Where were you then? Nothing I say will make you feel whole again, but we truly are doing everything we can. What about exterminating those animals? The Flesh Raiders won't stop until we're all dead. Are you going to let that happen? I won't quit until the Flesh Raiders are defeated. That's a promise. We'll see what a Jedi's promise is worth. I hope you can fulfill that pledge. I fear he won't take disappointment well. People wonder why Jedi are forbidden to marry or have families. They don't see how attachments always lead to suffering. Passionate emotions can destroy a person, and Jedi destroyed by passion become something terrible. T7 was captured by the Flesh Raiders. You'll want to see the hollow recording he made. While I deal with the droid, talk to Rana. I think her people are ready to help us, thanks to you. With the weapons and technology you brought from the Flesh Raiders, my people can defend themselves. Your heroism gives me hope that we'll survive this. And your matriarch? Is she feeling any better? No, but we're doing all we can. Thank you for asking. Morant? Our friend should know everything we've learned about the Flesh Raiders. Scouts report that the Flesh Raider forces are gathering in strength. They already control the mountains around us, and now they're invading the ruins of Kaleth. 
My men spotted them at the remains of an ancient shrine, close to your Jedi temple. Kaleth was a great city of Force users. Its ruins hold powers we still don't understand. The Flesh Raiders are looking for something there. We can't let them find it. Drive back those Flesh Raiders immediately. I have to take this droid back to the Council. That hooded figure in the holo, I know his voice. The situation is worse than I thought. Do whatever it takes to push the Flesh Raiders out of Kaleth. I'll send you reinforcements as soon as possible. I'll hold the line until reinforcements arrive, Master. If you see that hooded figure from the holo, do not engage him. I get going. 